In this video we demonstrate how to export and import projects. P6 XML format, MPS XML and UNC FAC XML formats are supported. P6 XML enables project baselines to be imported and exported with the project. Select the Actions drop down to start. Select Import Export. Select XML Project Import Export. Select the Export tab. Primavera XML is selected. Click Browse to select the project to export. Expand the project structure. Expand another project node. Expand the project node. Select the project. Click the Assign button. Click the Select Baseline ellipses. Check the Export box. Click OK. Click Export. In the Status tab, click the Refresh icon. Export runs as a job service and may take an extended time to complete. The job has completed. Click Download File. Select Save File. Click OK. Click Cancel to close the window. Click the Notifications box in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. In the Notifications window, select Download File. Choose a format to open the file with and select OK. Review the file content. Do not make any changes and close the file. Let's import a file now. Select the Actions drop down. Select Import Export. Select XML Project Import Export. On the Import tab, select Browse. Select the file location where the XML file is located. Select the file. Click Open. The Import action chosen is Create New Project. Click the Import To selection icon. Expand the project structure. Expand the project structure again. Select the project structure. Click OK. Click the Select Baseline ellipses. Check the Import box. Click OK. Click the Template icon. The template controls which attributes will be changed during the import action. Both global and project attributes need to be validated before importing a project. XML import obeys the user's profile settings. Therefore a user with restrictions on global data will not be able to update this type of data. This provides protection for global attributes and the main database. Select the project tab. Review the project settings. Again, user profiles only in enable update of fields the user has the right to change. Protection for the project data. Select Cancel as no changes were made. Select Import. Click the Refresh icon to see if the service has completed. Alternatively, you can close the window and wait for the notification window to show in the bottom left corner of the P6 session. The service completed, click Cancel to exit. Refresh the page. The new project shows in the Enterprise Project Structure. Select the new project. Right click and select Open Project. Click Activities to open the Activities page. In this case the page is already open. Refresh the page. Click the Baseline icon. Highlight the project. Click the Project Baseline cell. The imported baseline is available. Select the baseline. Click the user primary baseline cell. Select the baseline. Save the changes. Close the window. This demonstration has shown how easy it is to export and import using P6 XML format. Also the ability to export and import project baselines improves management of project data and saves time. Thanks for watching this learning bite. Don't forget to check out the others in our collection or visit training.pressins.com.au for more options to gain great real-world skills in Oracle Primavera.